protect your DNA. BioPQQ can promote formation of new mitochondria. InfoWarsStore.com Jakari Jackson here with Justin Delosh of Lone Star Gun Rights. How are you doing today, sir? Doing great. How are you, Jakari? Doing very well. Now, we're here for a very specific reason at the Texas Capitol. You guys are hosting an event next week? Yes, sir. January 13th, 8 a.m. I need all Texas gun owners to meet me here at the, at the south steps of the Capitol for HB 195, the 2015 Texas Constitutional Carry Bill. And for people who don't know, what is constitutional carry? Constitutional carry simply means that if you're legally allowed to possess the firearm, you should be able to carry it openly or concealed without a permit, without having to pay for that right. Okay, so would this do away with uh, concealed carry and things of that nature? Absolutely not. And it actually doesn't do away with the CHL either. It just makes it voluntary in Texas. So if you still want the, the CHL for reciprocity reasons for uh, going across state lines, it'll still be there if you want to get one. It'll just be voluntary in Texas. And are you anticipating anybody coming out with uh, firearms? Are you promoting that for this particular event? After the event, uh, we're okay with people, uh, you know, carrying their firearms, but uh, I know that DPS probably won't still, still won't allow people onto the ground, so we're, we're suggesting that you stay outside the gates if you're going to do that. But if you're going to participate in our event, we, we prefer that you don't carry, bring an empty holster, constitution, whatever, because the thing is we want to go into this building here and we want to talk to the legislators, and we can't do that with our firearms right now. Right. CHLs you can, just not openly carried. Okay. And when you say you're going to talk to the legislators, what exactly do people need to prepare for? Well, we, we have some leaders already designated for our groups. We're going to break off into groups, and we're going to be visiting all 181 legislators, and we're going to be dropping off petitions and just, just show up and allow us to do the talking. Now, Justin, I know there's a lot of bills being worked on right now. Why is this the one that you guys want to focus on? Because this bill fully reinstates our rights that have been taken away from us over 140 years ago without due process. It now turns our right into a real right versus a privilege. It makes the CHL voluntary in Texas, therefore we don't have to pay in order to carry, in order to exercise our rights. And you guys have done a lot of marches, many more than I can document. What is still left for Texas gun owners to achieve? There's a number of things. Uh, I think definitely this would be a huge leap if we get this bill passed. Um, there's some federal things we could do as far as uh, you know, the federal encroachments we have going on in, uh, amongst Texas gun owners and stuff like that. But I think right now our focus should be on getting this mammoth bill passed right now. And you also have a petition that you want people to sign? Yes, absolutely. Uh, even though January 13th we're going to be dropping off a large majority of our petitions, we're going to be doing it all session long. So if, if I'm asking your viewers that they would please sign the petition so that you keep us busy all session long. Because uh, ultimately the, the petitions are a showing of teeth and they show these legislators that this is a serious issue and that we are going to take it serious and that it, it, it could potentially cost them their, their jobs next time around. Governor-elect Greg Abbott says he will sign this bill should it make it to his desk. How much time do people have to get in action, get in the game before that decision comes? Well, we have, uh, we've got five months of session coming up. So uh, depending on when they, they choose, the, they're going to end up putting all the Second Amendment bills probably in a pile, and they'll probably dedicate a week or something like that to it. We don't know exactly when that's going to be yet. But uh, if you go to LoneStarGR.com, you can keep up to date there, or you can find us on Facebook. And that, that's mainly our goal is to keep everybody up to date and tell people where to be and when to be there. It's going to be 8 a.m. to 6 p.m., and we're, we're begging people to stay with us. We know it's going to be a long event, but it's, it's very important that everybody stays with us. Thank you, Justin. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you. You can find more reports at InfoWars.com. Symbols are powerful, and the globalists have hijacked the symbols of America. They've turned them into their own symbols. Well, we are restoring the idea of the true republic, not the counterfeit globalist empire, by promoting the icon George Washington and others. That's why we're rolling out on a 100% Made in America line of incredible pro-liberty apparel. We are repopularizing liberty, we are helping fellow Americans rediscover what made this country great. We are the spirit of 1776. We are 1776 worldwide. We are all brothers and sisters in arms in the animating contest of liberty in the long march towards humanity's ultimate destiny of freedom. Visit MadeIn1776.com today and vote with your dollars to promote truly made in America high quality products and promote the ideals of liberty.